today we are going to solve a problem of differential calculus this is a problem of finding limit of this expression we have to find what will be the limit of this expression that is x into 2 to the power x minus x divided by 1 minus cos x as limit x tends to 0 you might feel that uh, you can solve this problem using L'Hopital rule of course you can solving using that method but that will be very cumbersome because of this involved expressions which are given here first of all you see what is given in denominator we have been given 1 minus cos x so i can write 1 minus cos x is equal to 2 sin square x by 2 why i am changing this 1 minus cos x into sine term i am changing it into sine terms because i have got a very neat formula for sin x by x as limit x tends to 0 and I see that there is an x term in numerator also and so I can use this sin x by 2 and this x to arrive at the result so this expression I can write as limit x tends to 0 now this x I can take outside so it will become 2 to the power x minus 1 divided by this whole will be 2 sin square x by 2 2. Now you see in order to find the limit of this sin square x by 2 I need an x square term here then only I can bring this numerator x square in denominator and make it in this form like sin x by 2 divided by x by 2. Now in order to find the limit of this sin square x by 2 and this x what I will do I will multiply the numerator and denominator both by x when I multiply the both the numerator and the denominator by x I will get x square here and I will get an x here after this step I will use the formula that sin x by 2 divided by x by 2 whole limit x tends to 0 this limit will be 1 similarly if I take the square of this also the square of this whole expression as limit x tends to 0 will be 1 so I have to bring this sin square x by 2 somehow in this format so in order to bring this thing in this format what I will do I will take this x square from here and bring it here but I don't need only an x square I need an x square by 4 so I will divide it by x square by 4 and since this 2 is already here to make it 4 I have to multiply this by 2 so this will become 4 so this will become 4 and this 4 I am bringing here so ultimately this whole 4 will be removed so I can remove this term so what I will get and this x square has also been brought here so this x square will also be removed so here I will get a 1 2 and this x was will remain here and this is the whole thing now what is this whole thing as limit x tends to 0 this is 1 so this I can write as 1 now I have to find limit of this thing so I have to find limit of 2 2 to the power x minus 1 divided by x as limit x tends to 0 formula that limit x tends to 0 a to the power x minus 1 divided by x is equal to ln a so if you substitute in place of a you are having 2 here so so this whole limit will become 2 times ln 2 okay so this is the answer so in this method what we have done we have transformed this 1 minus cos x in sine term once I have got this as sin square x by 2 in order to find this limit I needed x square by 4 here so I multiplied the denominator and the numerator both by x so that I had x square here this x square I brought this x square I brought in here and there was a 4 here so this 4 came here now once this x square is removed once this is removed so this whole thing is 1 so I have to find the limit of this expression limit of this expression is 2 into 2 to the power x minus 1 by x this is very simple as ln 2 in fact if you don't remember this formula you can use the formula that this 2 to the power x I can write as 2 to the power x can be written as e to the power x ln 2 now if you expand it you will get 1 plus x ln 2 plus higher terms of x that is x square or something when you do minus 1 then this 1 and this 
minus 1 will be cancelled and this x is in denominator so this x and this x will be cancelled so you will get ln2 in fact the derivation of this formula that a to the power x minus 1 by x uses this expansion so ultimately we get 2 to the power x minus 1 divided by x is ln2 and this is 2 so the answer is 2 ln2